January's always been a really, well, for a number of years, been a really difficult time of year. I become a little bit depressed, not clinically depressed, but down. Things are different. And I knew January was going to be really tough. There was a lot of change going on. I needed something to focus on. Doing something like Red January, where I've got some sort of, something to look forward to, something that's going to motivate me to get out, do a bit of movement when it's dark and it's wet and it's cold. It's just been just incredible. It was a commitment and I guess there's a sense of accountability, isn't it? Accounting for what you've done. And I think what I liked particularly this year about it was being in a team meant we were all people who were quite open to have open yep. conversation. So you just felt safe and like okay and then yeah you just feel like it's someone you've always known. Being part of a group, especially after a few days of the excitement of getting going. It can be really tough when you're doing it on your own. Community spirit, being part of a community. A safe space for people, like no matter what you're feeling. The happy hormones. I love the fact that there is there are these happy hormones that are produced when you exercise. It's also really lovely as well on social media where people are sharing like the Red January hashtag or you're seeing other people doing it and it motivates you. I love looking at my Instagram page for all of January and just seeing red, 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 red.